one of the states of the United States of America. And that small town of Florida is similar to ours in that it was all the same kid folk, the same skin folk, as Laura the Hurston would say. And so she was sort of isolated from the outside world. And as she uh, uh, got an education, as she moved on, she eventually graduated from Columbia University, yes, with Barnard College at the time, a woman's college in New York City. And she became a uh, 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 field study was anthropology. And anthropology is a very large field of study that studies cultures. And in this study, what she, uh, as a trained anthropologist, she learned a lot about uh, different cultures. She went on to become a very, very famous and renowned writer of novels and of things. And that's part of what was called the Harlem Renaissance. She was a very interesting woman. Uh, but in the end, you know, people forgot about her. It took uh, uh, many years after her, after her passing for people to understand what she was, what, what, what her power was in, in writing. Yeah. 